Good morning, everyone. I'm going to go ahead and do the um, journal page with you for this morning. Um, and I think we maybe had one or two more pages in the Christmas journal, but I'm going to we're going to go ahead and just skip those because Christmas is over. Um, but it is winter now. It's January. OK, it's January 11. So that's winter. So we'll go ahead and start our winter journal. So let's look at the first page. Okay, so I posted these in, I posted them on Google Classroom, but I think um, some of you might have already received these in your packets also. If you don't have it in your packet, let me know. Or um, they're on Google Classroom, you can always find them and uh, print them from there. Let me know though if you need it. Any help finding that or if you need me to send it to you. Okay, because we will be doing distance learning for at least a week. Hopefully by next week you can return to the classrooms, most of you. Okay, so let me go ahead and do the first page. So our first page is this one about snowflakes. So I am gonna print my name at the top of the page, my first name, and then you would do the same on your paper if you have it. Or you can complete it like I am on this Kami extension. There's a few ways to complete it. But if you need help with that too, let me know. If you want to complete it online instead of writing with paper and pencil, let me know. Okay, so it's January, so the month is one. So we're back to, to one, <laughs> the first month of the year. We finished the last month of the year, which was 12, now it's one. And it's 11, the 11th day of the month. And it's 2021 or 2021 or just 21. You can also just write 21. Okay. And so today I'm going to be writing about snowflakes. So I'm going to trace the word snowflake. Oh, let me make sure it's not too transparent. No. Lake. Okay. K. K. E. No way. Okay. So it's capital S. N O W, the O doesn't look too good, I know. Sorry about that. S N O W F L A K E. Okay, I'm going to trace I, capital I, C, I C S E, E, the, Okay, I see the what? The snowflake, the snow crystal, or the snow? I'm going to circle the snowflake. It, capital I, T, it has H-A-S, it has crystals, lines, or designs. Okay, well, it does have designs. I don't know if you know much about snowflakes, but every snowflake is different. Every snowflake, there's millions and billions of them in the world. Everyone looks different. They have a different design. They're all unique. Okay, it also has crystals, ice crystals. I guess we can, I can circle crystals. That's what I'll circle. And it has lines. The lines make the designs. Okay, the capital T H E the snowflake S N O W F L 
Okay. Hmm, the snowflake is I S. The snowflake is tiny, cold, or blue. Uh, we'll circle blue. The snowflake is blue. You'll see right now why. Okay, I, capital I, think, T, H, I, N, K, I think, it is pretty unique or freezing. I think it is unique. I'll say unique. Remember I said they're all different, they're all unique. Okay, so now I'll go ahead and complete my sentences. I see the snowflake, period. It has, period. The snowflake is blue, period. I think it is unique and U N I Q U E period. Okay, so now my sentences are complete. Now I can go ahead and color my snowflake. And I'm gonna color it blue since I said that's what it is. Color it blue, maybe a little bit lighter. I'm going to change it, make it a little lighter. Okay, so I'm co I colored my snowflake blue. And now I will draw a snowflake. And that might be a little tricky. Okay, I'm just going to try my best to make a snowflake. I don't really know how to draw a snowflake. Uh, But remember, all snowflakes are unique and different. So there might be a snowflake somewhere in the world that looks like this one. Okay, so my snowflake does not look exactly like a snowflake, but that's the best I can do. So I am going to go ahead and finish the, um, the lesson here. So this is our writing lesson for this morning. And I'm going to get that posted as soon as possible so I can go ahead and start our morning meeting. So I'm going to go now. Bye, guys. See you in, see you in a bit.